It's no cheese. Or it's cheese? It has cheese. Cheese with tofu. Mm hmm. What the fuck? Hey, what's going on, everybody? For First We Feast, I'm Sean Evans coming at you from Decoy and Red Farm in the West Village, where I'm joined by the Chinese hip hop sensation Higher Brothers. You know them from hits like Nomadic and Made in China, and they just wrapped their first ever North American tour. And that brings us to New York City, where Chinese food is a genre unto itself. From the Cuban Chinese joints on the Upper West Side to the hole in the wall spots where you can get chicken wing combos and spare ribs. So, today, what we're gonna be doing is rolling out iconic New York City dishes to see if they stack up to the Higher Brothers' <laughs> highest of high bars. Ooh. And before we get started, I know that you guys are just finishing up the North American tour. Yeah. Have you guys had a chance to eat Chinese food in America? And if so, what do you think? Well, in Toronto, we eat uh, Chinese food and uh, we're LA. In LA, we eat Chinese food. But LA. It's, no. it's different. It's okay. Yeah. It's okay, but not like the well, real Chinese it's food. It's not Chinese food. It's, uh, yeah. it's like American way Chinese food. Yeah. The hair Chinese food just look like Chinese food. Yeah. The inside <laughs> is different. We're making the way from Chengdu, but I know that New York hip hop mm -hmm. was very important to you guys. It was influential. Can you talk about the role that guys like 50 Cent, Jay Z, Nas, what they meant to you guys growing up? For me, I listen 50 Cent and I watch his movie, Get Rich or Die Trying. That's my first time understand the gangster culture. What's the connection is gangster with hip hop music? Then I fall in love hip hop music. It changed your life. Yeah. Yeah. Chinese Ali, Biggie. Ali is a Biggie. Just I watched a, a film about a Biggie in Chinese. I watched this. I know it's a legendary shit. It's a story. I made a lot of things. I want to do something like a Biggie. So I try to write some lyrics. I made it. <laughs> biggie, Congratulations. Biggie, biggie. <laughs> Are you guys ready for the first dish? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, yeah. let's bring out some wings. Oh my god! Hey, she's so you guys bad. like the reveal? Oh, shit. Oh, oh, wow. First up, we have the famous Chongqing chicken wings from Mission Chinese. The wings are spiced with a mixture of Sichuan peppers, cumin seeds. You have some mushroom powder. The dish also has a honeycomb tripe. These are not your average wings. So I know that you guys are coming from Chengdu, which mm -hmm. has a reputation for being on a regional level, a place to eat very, very spicy food. How big a deal is spicy food? It's so important. It's just like, important. Yeah, just like Ch Chinese eating rice, yeah. Chengdu. Chengdu needs eating spicy food every day. <laughs> Should we try these wings? Because these are a little spicy. Oh, it's spicy. Spicy. <laughs> I told you, oh spicy. God. That's too spicy. Yeah. Too spicy. Only spicy. Yeah, Let's only pull spicy. the table. Is it too spicy? Is it not spicy enough? Is it just right? Mm, for me, it's spicy. For me, it's too spicy. <laughs> Are these spicier than what the wings you get in Sichuan? Sichuan spicy is more, more other taste, not only spicy. <laughs> But you keep going in. Is that because you're hungry? Is it no, because no, no, it's no, delicious? No, 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 no. Okay. Yeah, I like it. It was spicy. A lot of Chengdu food just like that. Right. You cannot eat too much, but you can't stop. Like hop hop. Right. At the end, everybody's ah, so spicy, but you can't stop. Your lips end up hot. Get rid. Your mouth Get ends rid. up hot. <laughs> yeah. And then it is just so delicious that you keep going back and back and back <laughs> for more, even though it hurts more and more and more and more. Just like the love. Yeah, it's, 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 it's just like love. Well, you know, I saw on the road the other day that you guys were eating Popeyes, so I guess this is how we'll deliver a verdict. Would you rather have the Chong King famous chicken wings from Mission Chinese or Popeyes? This. This, I think this. This is better. <laughs> Sign it, seal it, stamp it, mail it. On to the next dish. Bring, Bring in, in more. more. Bring in more. <laughs> Bring in more. <laughs> All right, very excited for this one right here. This is the General So's Chicken and Waffles from Sweet Chicken Brooklyn. 
fried chicken, it's tossed in a sweet General so sauce, and then laid on a rice and broccoli waffle. Fun fact, this spot that we got this from, it's co-owned by Nas. By Nas? Yeah. I, I feel that. like you guys are already a fan. Yeah, that's my favorite way, American breakfast. It tastes like ice cream. I like it. I don't want to speak. <laughs> I can't take this chicken. The chicken's a little much. No, I mean, the sauce is yeah, so the sauce, it's not good. Too, too much like, sauce. Too much sauce, yeah. Too much sauce. Oh. A little too much sauce on the chicken. I yeah. like when a dish gives you two options, so that if one of them bricks, <laughs> yeah, you yeah, always yeah, have yeah. one that can save your meal. <laughs> yeah, you know? That's why I love the chicken waffle. <laughs> yeah, it's the best. If the chicken is not good, you can eat the waffle. All right, so what we have here is the ultimate Americanized Chinese dish. You know, General So's chicken and waffles. I'm wondering, what do you guys think? What's your take on this one? This is good. I like Sweet. It. Give you options to choice. Mm, waffle is good, but uh, the sauce on the chicken is bullshit. <laughs> I <laughs> fucking love it. Up next, we have the Mapo Tofu Chili Cheese Fries from King Noodle. King Noodle. King Noodle. What does that mean? Potato noodle. Where's the noodle? They're a thin cut French fry topped with Sichuan pork chili, melted oh, cheese, and, and scallion. And tofu. And tofu, which you're a big fan of. This is cheese? Yeah, we like tofu. It's no cheese. Where is cheese? It has cheese. Cheese with tofu. Mm hmm. What the fuck? <laughs> so. This is the type of cultural mashup that can either go really good or really bad. What's your verdict here? French fries is good, but um, cheese? Doesn't go with tofu. Not good. I love the cheese fries, but this with tofu is like, like I love the gooch can, but it's a gooch can remix. <laughs> Not the real one, you feel me? Uh... <laughs> When you have a McDonald's tattoo on your neck, how do the fries stand up? Are these McDonald's level fries as good, not as good? Where you stand on the fries? I like the McDonald's French fries better yeah. than this. Because this and is cold. I like yeah. hot French oh, fries. Yeah. Hot, just I like fries. Like just like French, 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 There you go. Little yeah. bit of salt. Crispy. Yeah. Hot. Not just mixed in with the tofu and the yeah. cheese. <laughs> Serve room temperature. But don't worry, we have one more dish left one to save dish. our meal. One more dish. Bring out one more dish. The last <laughs> dish. Let's take it home. Simona. Last but definitely not least, we have the Katz's Pastrami Egg Roll from right here at Red Farm and Decoy. They stir fry cabbage, peppers, celery, and oyster sauce in a wok and mix it with pastrami from Katz's, the century old Jewish deli on the Lower East Side. And then what you do is you double fry it right here in the tempura batter to make it extra crispy. And then you serve it up with a honey mustard dipping sauce. That's how we do it, boys. Dripping sauce. I'm trying to read between the lines on all the mm, 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 mm. Does that mean this is good? Yeah. <laughs> that means we can speak. For the Hair Brothers team, Only can make a noise. If you, you listen to mm, 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 that means that. That's a good sign. Ooh. Good as fuck, that means. So this is your first time eating pastrami? What? Which is that What's meat? Pastrami? It's the meat that you have in this egg the roll. Meat. So this is made with meat that's brined, seasoned, smoked, and steamed. Does it taste like anything that you grew up eating in China? And this tastes like Zhang Yu Xiao Wanzi. Yeah. In China, we have a food that we call the Zhang Yu Xiao Wanzi. Octopus ball. Octopus ball. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Some street food in China. Yeah, yeah. Just like hot dog on the street. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we've had four dishes today, boys. Okay. Okay? What I need to know is your favorite one of the day. Everybody's got to go down the line. What okay. is your favorite okay. dish? Okay, okay, okay. No, I need a time to choice. For me, yeah. it's the first one. The spicy chicken wing. You like the Mission Chinese wings? Yeah, I like that. For me, it's the last one. It's very hot. 
the egg roll hit the spot for you? Yeah. I like yeah, it. I think the number one is this. I need a hard food. And for me, it's the cheese fries. The cheese fries? Yeah. So we have the cheese fries. We have the Mission Chinese. We have the egg rolls from Katz's. And you know what I liked? <laughs> the chicken and waffles from yeah. Sweet Chick. A little too much sauce, but just like you, my man, eye to eye on that. It's my favorite you meal as well. Yeah, I you feel, feel you, I feel you. Same wavelength, brother. All right, well, there you have it. The Higher Brothers and Sean tasting iconic New York City Chinese dishes. Did they jump over the bar? Some of them. Some of them slammed their head against the bar. Some of them didn't reach the bar. And some of them did backflips over the bar. And that's why you gotta try it. And here we are at the end. You have to check out the two EPs. They're everywhere. Woo! Journey to the West and Type, type three. 3. And then if you just want that good, good New York City Chinese food, you have to come to Decoy and Red Farm. That's it from Sean. That's it from the Higher Brothers. Thank you for coming through, my guys. Thank you, Sean. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We made that. Till next time, Internet. Higher. Die, die, die. die. I fuck with that meal. I fuck with that meal. I fuck with that meal. Chicken and waffles. Chicken waffles. I fuck with that. That's what I'm talking about. You know what the fuck is going on, bro? I will finish it all right now. Believe me. Chicken and waffles. I fuck with them.